In this week's Bleach, Ichigo learns the truth. I am your father. That's not true. That's improbable. Bleach Chapter 673, Father, begins with Renji carrying Rukia through the rubble when they get caught up in the regeneration of Thor. Oh my god, it looks like a huge... Hacker! As he continues to take form, Hitsugaya tells them to stay out of it as this is not the same person they fought. But Renji is extremely confused. Who the hell are you anyway? Rukia says it's obvious who they're speaking with. It's Hitsugaya's older brother. Yes! Definitely. But then everyone begins to notice this huge amount of spiritual pressure coming from the castle. Rukia knows that it's Ichigo. That's goddamn right. Ichigo stands before Bach, who tells him to draw his blade. He's left himself full of openings, is what he'd like to say. What in heaven's name are you talking about? It's far from the truth because Ichigo is releasing so much Riatsu that it's taken a visible form. He's attained his true original power. Such odd praise coming from Bach. Um, everyone is sucking my d now, and you sure as shit should be too, you back-ass twaddle f Bach admits that he's not using his almighty power because he wants to savor the moment between father and son. Ichigo denies this relationship, but Bach tells him Ishin was just a surrogate, and he should have heard by now the true source of his power. Son of a bitch! Did you not know, or did you just not care? Ichigo freaks and says Bach is not his parent because he killed his parent. Bach says if this is about his mom, then Ichigo is still the petulant little schoolgirl he is. <laughs> This infuriates Ichigo, as it should, and he whips out his first Zangetsu blade. This asshole's trying to show me up. Let me show you how it's fucking done, bro. You can see the spiritual energy Zangetsu emits. Oh boy, it's time for a new attack. Nope. No, Getsuka Tensho. Dude, do some cool shit. The Getsuka is blocked thanks to Bach's darkness, and then he tries to attack Ichigo. But luckily, Orihime is there to deflect it. I'm the girl that just saved your ass. As the darkness keeps coming, Ichigo at last decides to use his other Zangetsu blade and charges Bach, but it doesn't end well. Ah, okay. Rethink that move, son. Bach tells Ichigo to quit his sulking. A person's life was taken so that he could have the sustenance to give birth to him. Wait, what? Oh my god. I don't know if I can let that slide. So you see, there's nothing to lament because there's no greater joy in the world. Yeah, that seems to be the right feeling when you find out that you're a mother and a father. I'm so damn confused. <laughs> he sends Ichigo flying and says their chat is done as he will bear witness to his glory. Oh, you guys made me eat. So this chapter was interesting to say the absolute least. We got literally no advancement with the fight with Thor, just saw that Rukia and Renji arrived and came to the conclusion they were meeting Hitsugaya's older brother. I will admit this did make me laugh because of the sheer stupidity, but also because Hitsugaya just went along with it. Probably because it's quicker than explaining his Bankai all over again. But with these two returning, I believe it will lead to them being told to go help Ichigo. I still remember Urahara saying that he was leaving everything in the hands of Kurosaki and Kuchiki. I'm certain she will play some sort of role in the battle with Bach. Hooray! I'm useful! And all that stuff with Ichigo and Bach. Holy shit, my head hurts. Bach is so fucking vague and it drives me nuts. Calling himself his real father, but also saying Masaki gave him the energy to give birth to Ichigo. What What does that mean? Seriously. We saw the origin of Ichigo's powers with the everything but the rain arc. Aizen had way more of a hand in Ichigo's birth than Bach ever did. I genuinely have no clue how to make sense of all this. Even if I thought it had something to do with the Soul King, it still wouldn't make a lick of sense to me. I'm sorry, if I'm missing something that you're all picking up on, but I'm seriously frustrated, and it's because of that fucking faggot. So I'll give this chapter a 7 out of 10. Rukia and Renji might be on their way to help. Ichigo is going all out with both Zangetsus, but Bach's talk about bringing Ichigo into this world hurt my head. For my question of the week, please make sense of what Bach is saying, because unfortunately I can't. So throw some theories out there for me. Favorite comments always featured in the next review. Here are last week's winners. All right, that does it for me. I'm sure you guys saw, but I have been busy uploading reviews for other series. Feel free to check them out. I just felt like I needed to expand my series a bit. I'll see you guys next week with Box Wondrous Glory. Peace.